Now we'll take a look at how we can copy-paste keyframes from one clip to another, which can be kind of handy in After Effects. So in order to do so, we'll put another picture in our comp window. And to keep it consistent, we'll drag it, grabbing the icon to the left of the clip name, down to the bottom. And I'll put my cursor over the edge of that clip on the left-hand side drag to my playback head and hold the shift key. So our clip is going to begin the new one will begin at 15 seconds. Now let's keep it kind of consistent. So let's just change the scale to 50% as well. Leave that static and place it in the center of the comp like so. And now I'm going to go up to clip number three and I'm going to select the word rotation. I'm going to click on the word rotation. And once I've done that, I'm going to hit Command-C on the keyboard. What it did was it copied those two keyframes. Now, it all depends on where the playback end is at this point. So this is exactly where I want it to because, because this is where I would like this clip to start to rotate. So I'm going to select picture number four, and I'll simply hit Command-V. Now, if I were to open the Transform tab, like so, you'll see now identical keyframes for rotation appear on layer number four as well. And if you were just to move these two, you'll see that these two are identical to these two. So let's go ahead and we'll preview what we have. I'm going to stretch out my work area more. I'm going to isolate it just to this area with these two clips to save some time. And then if I put the playback head anywhere inside the work area, this is important, then tap the space bar to build the preview. It will play and loop the area that we have defined with the work area. So we'll give that a moment. Now I'll tap the space bar to, to play this clip. And you'll notice that goes from three to four, and they both have the same identical rotation keyframes based on the copy-paste.